Whatever it is, the 36-year wait is over. Argentina just beat France in what might have been the best World Cup finals ever. The game came down to the wire and in the end, a good old-fashioned shootout. The game had everyone at the edge of their seat through the full 90 minutes of regulation, not to mention the extra 30 minutes that was played after things were left tied at 2-2. Lionel Messi scored Argentina's third goal in extra time and then Kylian Mbappe responded, tying it up yet again, sending the match into penalty kicks where Argentina kicked it out. After three straight goals from Argentina and two misses from France, Gonzalo Montiel had a chance to clinch it, which he did by putting the ball in the back of the net. France goalie Hugo Lloris didn't stand a chance driving in the other way. The two stars of each respective team, Lionel Messi and Kylian Mbappe, scored their penalties and the rest of the Argentina squad did your job too. But two French players missed. It's truly a shame because Mbappe was literally the only guy on his team to keep them in the fight, scoring all three goals, earning a hat-trick and giving the squad the morale to play on. But it still was an explosive game up until the very end, with tons of back and forth, up and down the pitch, and a lot of great soccer put on display for the entire world. Sports fans couldn't have asked for anything better really. This, this was one for the books, no doubt. This one is truly special for Lionel Messi. He needed this. The World Cup title was the only thing that he was missing. And now there should be no debate about who is the greatest player of all time because Messi is the greatest player we've ever seen. His legacy is cemented. He brought the World Cup title back to Argentina. Let me know what you think in the comments down below.